hi, hello, you can talk, and everything else. So, the subject of today is to decide what you do with the army in the city. We can either surrender right now, or we can fight until the end, or until a relief force comes. We should fight to the end? Because, like, they're only peasants. How will they fight us? They are, they are just farmers, peasants, just hunters. They, are, they aren't good at shooting. Well, we only have, like, 20 hunting rifles at most. If the are hunter, then they probably have a pistol. They're literally just peasants, and we're a elite fighting force. Yeah, I like what you said, Mike. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. We will be able to crush them underneath the might of our powerful fist and reinstate authority into this town. Yeah, we can easily fight them. At most, a lot of them probably just have sticks, clubs, and anything else that they could have found in the basement or on the street. They're literally just street fighters. They're just unarmed peasants with whatever they could find on the street to attack us. We will easily put down this rebellion. Sorry to interrupt the uh, very important um, speech or Congress business, but um, I think this is pretty important. What is it? Well, it's actually about the report of foul casualties and other things. So, we have 744 troops, and they have 5,000. And if we thought that was already bad, they have many rifles, artillery pieces, and basically anything else they will need to cross us. Also, I think I saw that they have lost a lot of supplies, and they're probably about to start a, count a counter attack against any land that we have gained, and they're probably going to murder some murders all in like a week. So, what was the terms of surrender? Was it like unconditional or conditional? Like, what kind?